Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is Sunday, September 20th, 2020, Reiwa 2. I was surprised to get this package in the mail. It's a 2020 Japan Census. It comes every five years. In Japanese, it's called Kokusei Chosa no Onegai. Request for cooperation in the 2020 Census. Up until now, I've been answering this on paper, from your smartphone. but now, or I'm going to answer this through the internet. You can answer this through your smartphone or your computer. Request for cooperation in the 2020 census. If you're answering through the internet, you have until September 14th, Monday, to October 7th, Wednesday. All right. You can either scan it by QR code and do it from your smartphone, which is small I don't recommend it or you can use your laptop or your desktop and that's what I'm going to do let's look at the contents this is juyo that means important you can either fill this out and then there should be an envelope yep here it is this is a prepaid envelope. You don't need to put any postage on this. It says over here, no stamp required. Okay. And then after filling this out, you fold it neatly and you put it into this envelope. Then you peel off this tape. It's an adhesive and you fold it and then you post it in the mailbox. So you have the manual way of answering it. Number one says, Setai ing no su. That means the number of people in your household. And then how many males and how many females? Let's continue. And here's an example of how to write things. I know it looks overwhelming. Don't worry. This is the instruction booklet. If you can read Japanese, then go ahead and do this. If you can't read Japanese, ask someone who can help you. Someone reliable. So it shows you exactly how to fill this out in Japanese. Here you have to write the prefecture, city, and the ward here as well prefecture and city you need to be able to read and understand enough Japanese in order to fill this out so this is perfect for Japanese speakers or for people who know enough Japanese now, if you do it from your smartphone or from the computer online, you have a choice of language. Look, you have Japanese, English, Chinese, traditional, simplified Chinese, Korean, Vietnamese, Portuguese, and Spanish. Or you can Chosa search online. Or type the URL e dash kokusei.go.jp Log in using your ID and access key. So I might blur this out. Follow the instructions to submit responses. Okay, let's get to it. In the URL, I'm going to type in e kokusei.go.jp. JP is for Japanese. On the right, you can change the language from Japanese to English, Chinese, Korean, Vietnamese, Portuguese, Spanish, but I want English. Senses online. On the top left, you can change the size of the font, small, medium, large, color, standard, or inverted. 
The census is the most important statistical survey for identifying the population and actual state of households. In red, please answer by October 7, Wednesday. Beware of suspicious email. Up to nine persons per household can answer. You can go ahead and check these yourself. All right, let's start answering. Type in your login ID that was given to you. When you're done, select Next. Enter your access key, then log in. Now I'm in Answer Input, and I want Start Entering. One, number of household members and type of household. Here it says one item out of 16. So you need to enter the number of males and females in your household. In my case, I have three males, including myself, and two females for a total of five household members. Then under type of household, it's ordinary. Select the one that fits you, then hit next. Page two, name and sex of each household member. When you're done, hit next. Page three, relationship to the householder. I am assuming that you are the head of the house like me, so you will be at the top and you should select the first one. At the bottom, it tells you three item, page three. When you're done, hit next. Page four, fill in the year and month of birth for each household member. Meiji, Taisho, Showa, Heisei, Reiwa, Christian year, that's what I prefer. Once you enter the year and month for each household member, it'll automatically calculate each person's age. When you're done, hit next. Page five, marital status. This page displays all the members with their ages and you have to choose the appropriate marital status for each. I'm married, so I will select married. For your children, select unmarried. When you're done, hit next. Page six, nationality. Enter your nationality and each member's nationality. Then hit next. I am selecting other because I'm from Canada. When you're done selecting for each, hit next. Page seven, period of living at the present domicile. This is asking you, how long have you been living at your present address in Japan? After you enter all the information, Hit next. Page nine, schooling. If you or anyone in your family is a student, select student or graduated or preschool. In my family's case, my wife and I have already graduated. Our kids are still students. When you're done, hit next. Page 10, work during the week. If you're working, select engage in work or engage in work while housework. That means you're doing housework as well. Or attended school and worked. Those who did not work at all, select one from this group. Hit next when you're done. Page 11, place of work or schooling. You have home within the same ward, another ward or city, town, village. I work at home, so I select home. If you or your partner works within the same ward, select within the same ward. If your children go to school within the same ward, select within the same ward. Select another ward if you or anyone else in your family works outside of your own ward or goes to school outside of your own ward. When you're done, hit next. Page 12, means of transportation to place of work or schooling. Choose the appropriate one. When you're done, hit next. Page 13, employed or self-employed. Choose your type of employment. I'm self-employed, so that's what I will select. When you're done, hit next. Page 14, name of workplace and kind of business. Under name of workplace employer, you would write the name of the company that you work for. So let's say ABC shoes or ABC supermarket. 
And under kind of business, if it's a supermarket, you would write supermarket or in Japanese, supermarket do. All right. In the description of work, you would write your title. So, reji na hito or cash register clerk. When you're done, hit next. Page 15 and 16. Looking at 15, housing. Page 15 and 16. Looking at 15, housing. Select the kind of housing. I own a house, so I'll choose the first one. 16, type of building. Detached house. Complete. When you're done, hit complete. Hang on, guys. You're not done yet. You need to enter your telephone number and your address. When you're done, select Confirm. After you confirm your phone number and your address, you need to set a password and send it. Your password must use both half-width letters and numbers, and it must be between 8 and 32 characters. When you're done, press Send. Congratulations, guys. You did it. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to my channel. Bye.